uh, I just wanted to turn attention quickly to um, to look at real estate. So, of course, um, with Wealth Migrate, the aim is to is to look at uh, at real estate and providing access to you know to really great uh, real estate to those who haven't had access previously. But how are we how are we going to see changes happening in the real estate space given given that our homes and our offices are going to be augmented with devices that are that are connected to the internet um so we how are we going to see a change what what is you know what can we see that's going to really make a difference uh, in the in in that space um for for me, um, uh, real estate is, is is part of what I call in, in in my analysis of network society the manufacturing pillar. It is our ability to uh, create uh, ever more sophisticated dwellings uh, uh, through technology and to to live and work in them uh, across the world. It is very very natural for these uh, uh, to be internet connected. Um, and there are already uh, startups, uh, some of them uh, I'm, I'm uh, advising and mentoring, that are applying Internet of Things technologies, for example, in the construction phase of a building, in order for it to be more dependable, more cost effective, reducing insurance costs, uh, uh, making everything more traceable, uh, and in general, uh, making sure that a very ancient and a very um, conservative industry uh, can move uh, and adapt to the needs of the 21st century. Um, real estate um, uh, is uh, uh, not going to evenly adopt uh, uh, these these changes. Uh, we, we we still have. Uh, Technologies uh, of two, three, four thousand years ago being uh, used uh, in in real estate, but you know um, uh, the 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 say uh, by science fiction author William Gibson, the future is already here. It is just not evenly distributed yet. Is absolutely true in this field too. Um, in uh, China, uh, for example, we've seen incredible. Uh, videos of uh, skyscrapers being built literally in, in three weeks uh, with very, very high standards of uh, earthquake resistance, uh, pollution reduction, uh, comfort of living, uh, uh, and, and, and in general of quality. So there are some, some pretty neat uh, uh, things that are, are happening. Another technology that uh, will take time to spread in real estate, but is going to create uh, uh, amazing types of buildings is a, a, a new elevator design that is capable of moving horizontally, not only vertically, uh, within the same shaft, uh, or I mean the same um, vehicle. You are in it, and and yeah. you you say, okay, I I I'm in column uh, one uh, on level ten, and I want to go in column four on level twenty, and and the elevator takes you there, right? Um, uh, these these are going to be incredibly liberating to architects, and uh, probably in in Dubai or or some or Shanghai, uh, or some of these uh, other places, uh, we will we will see uh, amazing science fiction worthy buildings uh, pretty soon. Yeah, no, absolutely, and, and and that's not to mention the smart glass that I think we're going to see and so many other things. Scott, would you like to pipe in there just in terms of what what you think? You know, guys, and, and uh, for those of you, I've been uh, playing with the polls because I'm always fascinated with what people's thoughts are and where the world's going. I think one of the things that, that amazes me that um, is, is I'm at a, this conference and I was talking to an estate agent today. And he's not actually an estate agent. He, he owns an entire estate agency with hundreds of estate agents. And what was really interesting talking to him was, you know, he says, you know, in many countries it takes over three months to transfer a property. And, you know, and he has to wait for his commission. Okay. Now, look, granted with blockchain, he's probably not going to have a job anyway. But the point being is that if it was to transfer in a couple of minutes or seconds, 
you know, it, it, it makes a significant difference. And so to answer your question on real estate, you know, I, I, I think industries like that are going to be turned on their head completely, right from construction to what type of buildings are needed to how the whole process is going to work down to the deeds office and everything. And I almost think that it's it's almost a white piece of paper because the whole old system is basically broken. Um, so yeah, I could talk about that for two hours, but I'm not.